was good, bro. Yes, sir. We fucking did it, guys. We fucking, we fucking did it, bro. You play with and you fucking play with Hey, guys. Welcome back to the channel. So, lately, I've been seeing black bones everywhere on TikTok, Twitter, YouTube. Apparently, it's because of a single back in uni and the stones he pulled directing the video himself. So, it was a huge success and now I'm thinking, why is it now this guy is just getting relevant? I mean, where has it been all these years? So I made some research and we're going to be looking into who Blackbone is and where he has been all these years. So guys, Black Bones or Black Bones, I don't know. His birth name is Emeka. I guess those who know him must know that because, you know, aside Black Bones, some know him as Emeka the Stallion. I don't know why he named himself that, but okay. So guys, he's a rapper, apparently, or uses the trap style. This guy has been out for quite a while now, guys, since 2018. Why is it just now we're hearing about him so much? I mean, his first EP debuted in 2018 called Bad Boy Black. I guess the track went on hard in that too in 2018, which I didn't hear of though, but he's been active since way back. So guys, Black Bones is an evil guy, as we all could have suggested from his name, Emeka. He's 26 years old, he graduated from Obafemi Awolowo University, I'm sure my Nigerian guys know the school, he studied engineering. So guys, Black Bones has been all about rap music since way back. He has gone for competitions, he has won some. Some of the notable rap competitions he has engaged in is the Teritha Rapman's Zombie Competition way back in 2012, guys. Like, this guy has been on this rap thing since way back for real. Five years after, he emerged first runner-up in Vector's King Kong Competition. Also, amongst many other competitions this guy has gone through. So guys, I guess Black Bones is part of the few Nigerian artists that still believe in rap, despite the lack of large acceptance from the Nigerian audience, though now he's basically singing, trapping, kind of. So guys, the main thing I'm looking for is, before now, where has he been? Cause I'm sure I'm not the only one who had not heard Jack about him until the single back in uni, which just dropped like last month. So, after a little digging, I saw that this guy has been dropping EPs since forever. I found out that he did something in 2018 under Emayagba called Bad Boy Black, which was released through 100 Crowns, a label imprint of Chocolate City. I'm sure you guys know the label. I mean guys, since 2018, like, that's a long time for you guys to still be sleeping on him. I mean. Why are you all not listening to this guy? He has been trying his ass off for you guys. So guys, in 2019, he dropped another EP called Mr. Bombastic. That is another EP I knew nothing about. I guess the only one you all might be familiar with is the one he released in 2021 called Sex Over Love. It had decent tracks and I'm sure many of y'all heard of them. It had pretty nice features also like Nasty C, Joe Boy and the likes. Well, I guess it's from 2021 it started getting relevant and it really blew up this year. I mean, that's when I noticed eventually that he existed because guys, he really did try with the single back in uni, which I'm sure that's when y'all figured Black Bones out too. And also, the stunts he pulled with making the music video for the single, challenging T.G. Omori at his work, saying he directs the music video himself because he couldn't pay the money T.G. Omori requested, which caused his tear on Twitter and from there, everyone started talking a little about Black Bones. I mean, am I not correct? So guys, he has released another project called Young Preacher, a very nice work. It will be his second studio album, I think. Go check it out and come back here to drop what you think about Black Bones in the comment section below. Have you been a fan since 2012? Follow him since then. I doubt that though. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Bye guys.